I'm Natalie Allen. With summer here, many of us take the opportunity to get outside, maybe go for a hike, but what if we find ourselves out in the wild and without water? It's a question we put to our outdoor expert, Dr. Marcus Erickson. Hi, Dr. Marcus here. There's nothing like getting away from it all to enjoy some beautiful weather in the great outdoors. What if your getaway goes wrong and you find yourself lost in the wild? It's essential for survival to stay hydrated. The average person can go three weeks without food, but only three days without water. No matter where you are, whether it's hot or cold, there's a good chance you can always find water. If you're near trees, let them pump moisture from their roots underground right up to you. Take a plastic bag tied around a leafy branch. A shoestring makes a handy rope. Then wait a few hours. Evaporation from the leaves will produce drinkable condensation inside the bag. Even if you're lost in a hot, arid desert, there should be water sources nearby. Green vegetation in this dry riverbed is a good sign. Dig below and you might find water. You can also build a solar still and let the sun help you collect water. Dig a hole and place a cup inside. Lay a piece of plastic or even your raincoat over the hole. Use a rock to make a cone over the cup. The sun's heat will produce water vapor that will condense under the plastic and slowly fill the cup. And water collected from a solar still is pure enough to drink. One other tip, if you're camping in dry climates, the standard rule is to carry one gallon of water per person per day. We'll be right back.